And meanwhile, everybody else just kind of lumbers around, potbelly first, all around the town. Yup. Trundle, trundle, trundle. If this game were made any later, you could they would have accurate jiggle physics on all their stomachs. Uh, <laughs> only if it was made by Team Ninja. <laughs> no, then then all of them would have accurate jiggle physics only from the rib cage up. <laughs> that's what Team Ninja specializes in. That, that's fair. Boots. Which is why I question why they made uh, uh, got hired by Nintendo to make other M. Yeah, hers don't move. They're like metal. Yeah. Encased in you're metal. Coming, yep, oh, you know what? That's what we should have played for Halloween. No, get Other that's M, friggin- because it's there a Metroid go. horror game. <laughs> because it's a, it's a... No! I'm you... not doing nothing wrong! <laughs> running, 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 running! We, sh- we should play Metroid Other M for Earth Day, because it's a great example of a dumpster fire. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, um, <laughs> sure, if you if you want, and Chris want to go forward with that, I'm good. Be my guest to play uh, Other M, because I there. sure as hell am not going to play it. Close that. Is there anything you can put in front of that? No. And let me get, you gotta grab the, the booze grab and the those. handle again. Here. You know what? Is it just, did we take too long? Is that it? Possibly. Nope, get down. Inventory. There. And and then he's behind us. Well, he's not. Cool. Okay. Maybe it didn't register me yet. Oh fuck! No, that's right. That's supposed to happen. Okay. You didn't just die suddenly. No. Is there a reason we don't take the trap door handle with us? Because they need it. But for this. Oh son of a bitch! Of course we get locked into another situation. Fuck you too. You're not Asshole. very good at your job, are you? He's me or him? Him. He he's a case of ah oh, missing persons report. Well, they're not coming back. Someone snuck into this crime scene. Ah, fuck it. He probably broke an ankle. He ain't leaving. Whatever. You're dead. Then I get left. Yeah, there's no. All, in addition to no HUD, obviously, there's no explicit health bar or anything. Are you just randomly injecting yourself with morphine? Right now? No, I'm not. Uh, it is a thing I have that I can use, but it'll screw with my head because morphine. Yep. Okay. Also, you can OD on it, so yeah, bad stuff. But instead of... That is, an, that is a mechanic in this game, right? Like, if you just shoot up with morphine, you'll die? I think so. But I'm not 100%. I mean, that's so- what happens if you take two of those things... Beyond, you know, 24 hours in between, you're gonna die. That's what? a strong ladder. I, that's that really a weak that's ass a... wall. Come on. Why would you need the ladder to break the weak ass wall if it's so weak ass? Maybe stand on the ladder? Is there a jump? There, is. there we go. Of all games, to have a jump. Why would this one need jump? For jumping puzzles, of course. Yeah. Are there jumping puzzles? There are jumping parts. Oh. Of course there's jumping puzzles. That doesn't sit... Oh, congratulations. You, you found the uh, the dark room that has... Light in it. Yeah. Well, that's because this window is broken and the doors are open and there's nothing... And there's slats in the yeah. f- floor above that are missing. Like, this is... Yeah. This used to be the dark room before whatever happened happened. Someone failed their photography class. No, well, I mean, they, they were, uh... Bullets! They were just sitting in on the class. They weren't actually no gun. You know, taking it for a grade. Just bullets. I have eight bullets. For the pistol mm. that you don't have. And are never going to get. No, This I was get. programmed by people who don't know guns. Especially because it's 1915, so why is there... A pistol clip. Well, yeah, that's <laughs> not what a clip is. That's a magazine. Well, at the same time, why is there a pistol magazine in 1915? That's also uh, it, they Browning were standard. 19, yeah, yeah they, they this were is 1922. Well, even is in 1922, it still wasn't 
standard at all to have... Oh, you gotta manually unbolt the fucking door? That's not even the worst part when it comes to door mechanisms. Oh, God. Oh, why? Jeebus, just... why? Holy shit is right. Can we not? No, we, we have to. We must. <laughs> do, do we have to keep staring at dead people? No, I'm not gonna look at the dead lady. Except now, just to... Ah, from the stench in here, this new spawn must have kicked it a few, a few months back. back. A few months? Yeah! And you didn't smell that from downstairs? You know what, given Ugh. that Innsmouth is a <clears throat> It's coastal, a port town. It's a coastal fishing village. Oh god. Which means that the whole place probably reeks of dead, rotting fish. I'm surprised he can smell anything. Well, there go all of our Boston viewers. Thanks, Bat. Hello. Uh, <laughs> no? Hello. <laughs> Who are you? Do I know you? Lucas, Lucas Mackey. Mackey. Insmith doesn't get a lot of visitors. New names spread fast. Why is he down here? Because he's about to tell us. You're about the missing Burnham boy? Because he's looking for the missing Burnham boy. I'm a private detective. My client's a friend of the Burnhams. Seen the little <laughs> Markham? Your boy's been quite busy. What? What about you, man? But, but, excuse me, go back. <laughs> explain. <laughs> True enough, Jack. Nothing too exciting, I'm sorry to say. I'm a government. Please tell me that you're going to condemn every building here if that's what your job actually is. Please. Speaking of which, spoilers, that's not his real job. God damn it. Okay. Yeah, he looks normal. Clearly, he must be up to something. Oh, he looks like a fish person. He's clearly up to something. He looks like a person. He's clearly up to something. Yeah. He's not the player character. All right, Pat, watch eyes. out. Uh, God, it's so bright. <laughs> I had to close my eyes and cover it with my hand to keep that brightness. Yeah, closing your eyes and looking away is not cutting it. No, co cover them with your hand. It's, uh... Reiki. Nope, you have to sneak past the... Nope, he's gone at oh, this point. Right, because he already, he already locked me in the basement. Uh, oh, so you're, cellar. Cle you're clearly dead, so... The I fuck? Fucking... Oh, that's right. What? I have visions. Of course you do. But do you I have to? I won't tell him anything. Uh, are they threatening each other? To keep uh, me out of the loop. Hey, Pat. God. You better not tell them anything. I won't say shit. Good. He's still staring in the same direction! I work for the First National. I'm a friend of the family. I heard of the uh, No, he's just always staring at you, which is almost a little worse. <laughs> Wiping the side of his face with the back of his <clears throat> forearm. This guy, the fuck is wrong with his eyes? They're slightly bulging and don't quite look right. Uh, Elliot Ropes. Yep. Okay. Ropes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. No, not at all. I'm looking for a Brian Burnham. He works locally. In the first so why would the first national anything be in a town this remote and insular? Get lost, stranger. Yeah, get lost. All right, we're just gonna go down here. That fellow was just stringing. It's locked. It's locked. It must need to. He, he wasn't stringing you along about anything. He just refused to talk to you outright. Fuck off is not stringing you along. He's. I. Jack is a horrible detective. I'm just. Yeah. This clearly we're not playing Batman. This is the world's worst detective. See, what, what it is, is uh, Batman found out about this guy, investigated him a bit, and discovered, wow, I need to, I could do things a lot better just by, you know, asking any questions at all. Well, yeah, you just said that Batman investigated this guy a little bit, thus automatically <laughs> making him better than this guy. And thus, Batman saw this guy as kind of an anti-role model and just said... I'm going to do the opposite of whatever happens in this game. Suddenly, comic book franchise! Yay! That's odd. It was all over the Arkham Press. 
Must have been a bit of a local scandal. Them's Ooh, he said scandal. Innsmouth's not a town for rumoring and talking. It's it's not a town for rumoring and talking, despite the fact that you're the only one I told my name to, and then everyone knew who I was. Yeah. Yep. Fuck you, front desk jockey. Asshole who doesn't know what con customer service means. Is it just me, or is every NPC in this town just kind of set to spawn, staring in your direction, and then, oh shit, go about their business as if they weren't looking at you? No, that's that's uh, probably pretty accurate, but at least they're not set to spawn like Watson does in that one Sherlock game. <laughs> just shows up right behind you like that constable did. Just, <laughs> Do you need anything? Hey, pack. <laughs> I may strike you. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's why I didn't go much further with that gag there. <laughs> I like having teeth. I bet you do. They help you eat food. And, um, not look like these people in this game. Jeez. The station appears to be closed. The station appears to be closed. And it won't it open. It also appears to be a shithole. Because we're in fucking Innsmouth. Yeah. There was a... God, this place oh, is Oh, the Marsh fuck. Refinery. That's right. Hello. Not suspicious at all, man. He, he told me to meet him here. I know, but he's not suspicious. Nope. Not at all. He's totally not the cult leader. Seemed a nice enough fella. If a little rough around the edges... Lucas Mackey, if that is your real name... You're right. My last name is Dagon. Fade to black. <laughs> Funny you should mention that. Oh, god damn it, am I right? <laughs> no, but Shut Dagon up. shows up in this Son game. Son of a bitch! Very careful. Uh, a dangerous place. Okay. Not if I'm lucky, I survive the encounter. Ugh. Let me guess, you're not very lucky. <laughs> it depends on how well I play the game. If, if I play well, then I survive the encounter. I don't. I don't kill him. Not even well, close. No, because you can't kill any. Of, like that's that's kind of the problem when you introduce them in any other role playing game. You have to give them stats, and therefore they can be killed. Yeah. Which is not correct. Where's his place? I think the Wade's house is over on Dock Street. Uh, Dock Street near the back of the poorhouse. Oh uh, well, I guess I better hurry up to Wade's. <laughs> See, I'm angry again because, because that was that was right up my alley. You're just too uh, you're just too scared right now. I'm all tense, man. Yeah. See, this is why we should have kept the uh, the modem randomly beeping. Because, uh... <laughs> Beep. Not okay. <laughs> was that? Did you just walk onto Myth Street? No, I said South. South Myth Street. No, oh, great. Yeah. Otherwise known as Smith Street. Which is actually one of my... Uh, South Street and Town Square. So there's a subreddit called Smiths uh, that is streamlined episodes of Mythbusters that people have edited on their own volition. Oh, to get rid of all the extra... Yeah, they, they pare down some of the extraneous and repetitive uh, explanation of, of various uh, experiments. That's and they go. They take the B team build and the main team build and they consolidate all the clips together so you get one project to completion and then the next project that episode all at once and it takes a an hour long program removing all the commercials it's 42 minutes removing all the extraneous fluff it's less than 20 or not less than 20 it's, it's less than 30 minutes so, yeah. So you can binge watch Mythbusters episodes and don't lose your entire day, y just your afternoon. You get to cram high calorie science, just shotgun it. Delicious. Yeah. Without having to restart and, and train your brain to multitask, I'm making quotations with my fingers. Since we still have them, they haven't. Yes. You know, the people here in Innsmouth haven't bitten them off yet. Yeah. Some of them look like they've got the teeth for it, and, some eh. of, and the rest of them look like they want to, anyway. Ugh. 
So how do we get rid of this police officer so we can go that way? I don't for the life of me recall. It won't budge. We seem to be running out of doors and places to go. What happened here, Constable? Will he actually talk to us now? No. You can let me pass then? No. You'll have to go another way. Okay, so there He's is... He's just being an asshole. What you after now? You ever meet Brian Burnham? I couldn't rightly say that as I remember. The burglarizing of the First National is big news in the Arkham press. Oh my god. Nope, we're, uh, we're not allowed to go anywhere. No. Unless we just have to keep pestering this guy. The... I'm sorry, the what? The order. Isn't this a matter for the police? Yep, that too. Um, uh, thanks, Jack. That's my next question. Them's that looks after the affairs. Okay, so... so he gave us a new... He told us that the order is a thing. Oh, uh, yeah. Um... But there was another robbery at Waits Variety Store. That much is true? That's for certain. How did they break in? Just down them there steps. Old Tom Waits had locked up for the nail. Now you'll be able to open the door, most likely. Eh, maybe. If that's really the case... Uh, that's the sign of bad game design. Oh, okay. I think he's telling us that we... Yeah. He... Get lost. Stop your bothering me with questions. He isn't going to tell me anything useful. Well, we have learned everything. So he's either t uh, told us that we can now, how we can now open it. No. Nope. Or he's telling us that Mr. Wait will now spawn at his house, wherever the hell that happens. Down on Duck Street, which is past where he's standing, which is where I wanted oh. to go. Shit. Yeah, well, that jerk off. Is there any way to go up to the place so where you had your this vision? guy with that questions? bothering me with your talking maybe i mean right. it, it's new but that's that's sometimes the problem with these investigation type games is you have to just go around and keep asking all the questions till you run out of dialogue trees um which was kind of the problem with really old adventure games yeah i will admit that is a little bit of a problem with the beginning of this game is yeah, once i get through the first day it's no longer an issue. I'm, I'm getting kind of a Sierra vibe from all this. Just, you must do everything precisely the right way, in the right order, or you will die. Or you just can't it's, keep going. He's throwing up He's throwing up in the trash. Okay, he's, he's not like, eating he, out yeah. of the trash can. I'm glad I had that pegged accurately. Yeah, I'm I, kind I, of ashamed that I had that pegged accurately uh, so quickly. But, uh, have we talked to that guy? No, he's unimportant. Okay. Just wanted to double check. What's this Jacob Marsh like? Uh, he didn't show up for our appointment. Uh, but then again, the Marsh is never... I'm getting the sense that we have to keep bouncing around and just... Talking to people until, like, the game allows us to advance. Because that's not good. <laughs> Ugh, oh, slimy yeah, character, son of a Hello, bitch. Jack. What's the government's interest in the Marsh refinery? They're, they're really just, they're gonna go with it's all the puns without directly telling you yet. Oh, they, they do eventually tell you in this game? Oh, yes, abso fucking lootly. Okay, because cause that's the thing about some Cthulhu uh, or Mythos games, Mythos, Mythos, whatever games, that they, they like to just kind of dance around the subject instead of actually, like, you know what? You. You have decided to go with this property. Just embrace it, whole hog. Just mm -hmm. all the way. Reach in there with your slimy tentacle, wrap it around everything, and pull it out. Because, you know, at the same time... Freezing. <laughs> I know what I said. <laughs> That's the problem. Uh, yes. There's gossip that old Captain Obed Marsh brought the disease onto this port... His voice sounds kind of jaunty all of a sudden, now that I can hear it. Is that why so many of the townsfolk are suffering from that hideous affliction? Perhaps what do you call it hideous? Those from out of town call it the 
Insmith look. <sighs> Where did you say Waits house was again? I know it's on Dock Street. I take it that's the end of that guy's dialogue. For yeah. Now. Yeah, if he's repeating what he's already said. Can, can we talk to the girl? Do we have to... She told us before to leave her alone. So yeah. I think until we have an actual reason to talk to her, she's not going to tell us anything else. Why do you keep looking in that one room? Because there's a scary thing that happens. Like I'll never die. I lose my head in the starry skies. Can't change me down. I feel so alive.